Okay, here we go. College soccer after wins over Brown in the second round, Coastal Carolina in the round of 16, and Louisville in the quarterfinals. The Maryland men's soccer team is back where they feel they belong, the College Cup. Up next, a match with Georgetown in the national semifinals in Hoover, Alabama. We're excited as you can possibly imagine. Uh, I'm really proud of this team. Um, as I've said before, the preparation for this moment began, you know, literally days after we lost in last year's uh, round of 16. And uh, this was a hungry, committed, returning group. We made three goals at the beginning of the year. We wanted to be regular season champions, ACC champions, and national champions. And just being able to continue our journey has been unbelievable. And be a senior on this team, you know, it's been a great privilege to be able to, um, you know, watch a lot of these guys grow and be a leader on the team. We've had some great great teams before and since I've been here, but I just think there's a certain joy in just wanting to go out there and work and prepare each day and do the right things you have to do throughout the week to be ready for those big games on the weekend. And I think we're just going to keep continuing to do that this week, make sure we stay loose, and we'll be ready to go on Friday. Georgetown has had a, uh, a, a you know, a historical year, really a, a, a great year. You know, that we, their coaches, uh, Brian Weiss and, uh, uh, and their staff, have done a fantastic job. I mean, they, they deserve to be there. Nobody in this country has worked as hard as University of Maryland men's soccer team. Um, and because, as a result of that, we are extremely confident. We're well prepared. And, you know, we've played better in every game in the NCAA tournament. And on Friday, we want to play our best game of the year. For us to be uh, back where we belong, is a, is a great source of pride, but we are also not content with being there. It is not the end game for our program, and uh, we're hoping that when it's all said and done, that we're the last team standing. The Terps and Hoyas play Friday at 5 o'clock, followed by the second national semifinal. That would be Indiana and Creighton at 730.